we're back. Yeah, back to the financial fun times here in Devil Make Fuck. <laughs> right in the face. You know, I know how to play video games. I would That's guess it's in that game. room. Or do you have to break that door? Um, nope. Must be in the, Do you have to... Is there a thing? Get, can you get up on this ledge? Um... No? Anyway. We're playing video games sometimes. I don't know where you're supposed to go. Up on up Might on ledge above you? Here? They're like a thing you can grab onto? Cat, tell me what to do. I came in through there. Right? And go, that thing murders me. Go left and look up. Oh. Alright. I know how video games work. Thank you for paying attention. Like like in logically see something up there, and only shitty game designers make populated ledges that you can't get to. <laughs> It's true. It's like the main reason I know like the Order 1886 is gonna bother me when I eventually yeah. play it is that there's just a lot of shit that doesn't do anything. There's people bitch and moan about like the Call of Duty games doing that, but the big thing about like all the people firing guns and shit yeah. is they are actually like damaging others. Like they are affecting the world. Everything I've heard about Order 1886 is it's a very 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 good demo for another game. Yeah. Like, it's a very good, like, first chapter. I like that he just, like, turns into a Pokemon. Yeah. It's an evolution, don't you know? Oh. I also like that it, like, the porcupine quills are the right colors. Yeah. Just a little thing that I like. Yeah. It's, uh... These guys are good at paying attention to detail, if anything. Even when it's gross detail. Yeah, exactly. Is that yep. Yeah. Uh, is it timed or what is what's happening over here? <laughs> Just hell. Yeah. That that's totally fair. Well there's an elevator here, so I assume I'm supposed to take this. That would be my guess. Alright. Yep. You have to get it before the six six six, right? Oh, 105. Alright. <laughs> Come on. Come on. You're not giving it enough credit. Eh. Eh. Oh that's right, his his crystal is just because his brother and he have a crystal. His their brotherly geo crystals. All right. Oh shit. Keep forgetting we did like three episodes of this and then like didn't play it for like two months. What the hell is that? Do you have to slow down time to get through that? It's definitely yeah. There you go. Is that it? There's oh. a key that I've never gotten. That that's what There's those keys these look two like. Guys. Which. I fill your dark soul with light. Ah. All right. Isn't that a line from an earlier from game? From the very first. Oh. Damn nope. it. Are you slowing it down? No, it just slows down eventually. Oh, okay. So I just gotta wait. So it's just pay fucking attention? Yeah. All right. Great. Cool. I feel like I accomplished something by getting stuff I've never gotten. Um, so I want to go this You've way. played this through a couple times. Uh, I've played it through Turn completely down. once. Okay, and then you just do missions when you're bored. Yeah. Health! I'll I take think. it. Well, okay. Alright. Alright. That's fine. You know what? I can handle these. You know, if I can handle the financial district, which, let me tell you, those guys, they are snakes and sharks. Topical reference. Alright. Just want to play a nice, slow paced game after this. No, you don't. I don't? Nope. Okay, just chill out with the shield thing, please. Do you ever get an ability, like an Enslaved, where your health just, like, slowly regenerates on its own, or that attacking re that refills health? Oh. Not like you're, not like the bar, but just, like, passive. There. Boom! Um... No, basically it's just the devil trigger thing that's gonna do it for you. Okay, I forget this game is difficult. Yes, like, greed is great. Like as as these things go. All right, cool. It's over here. Anything interesting? Things that I want? Things that I need? Just conference tables. Just a conference room, where business meetings occur. Mandated Christmas parties that you must attend. 
regardless of religious affiliation. Yeah, that's why they're called holiday parties, but everyone knows. Yeah. Like, your boss is Jewish. He's just like, what, what, like, what, why do you have a Christmas party? He's like, uh, because I'm required to? <laughs> yeah. He's the answer. Like, like, I always wondered that. It's just like, what's the point of the holiday party? And it's like, because that's where they give out Christmas bonuses. Yeah. That, that was always my guess. Ah. Uh, or it depends. Or, like, my job doesn't have Christmas parties. You also have, like, three people in your office. Um, two. two. Just me and the boss. Okay. Not by choice, by the way. That is not by design. But anyway. So I don't have Christmas parties. Even if I did it. Like, I've gone to other people's Christmas parties. And it's weird when you don't know anybody. But... Well, I mean, I figure if you're, like, a spouse or something, that always happens. Yeah. Oof. Okay, right, there's a green thing over there. Is that health? Looks like something. And we don't die. Right. Nope, just... Upgrade points? Yep. Money. All right. All right. Yeah, the, uh... I, I feel like he the health. second you say uh, mandatory fun... Like, <laughs> I'm just, just thinking Weird Al. Oh, yeah. But the second you hit that point, it's just like, all right, well, no one will have fun. Especially because, like, as I understand, a lot of offices have, like, uh, dry Christmas parties. Yuck. Uh, why? Yeah, and I'm just like, if you're going to hang out with people you don't necessarily like but have to professionally deal with, alcohol seems the best solution. Yeah, exactly. And I say that having, like, written about Christmas parties that don't have alcohol. <laughs> you're a monster, you know? Yeah. Well, ah. did not oh. go super great. No. Now you're being punished with combat. Yeah. Punished with more gameplay. One thing I always found funny about, like, I think it's Assassin's Creed Revelations? Yeah, I think it's Revelations, because they stopped doing it after that one. It was like a tower defense minigame. Ew. Yeah. Uh, that you're actually... Uh, <laughs> the game rewards you by not making you do it. Okay. Because, like, if you, uh, it, it's terrible, but, like, it's the only new thing in that game. And, like, if you secure outposts, there's two, then they won't be attacked, and the only way you defend them is with the tower defense minigame. And so it's like, I'm rewarded by do for doing less gameplay. Yeah. Less terrible, terrible gameplay. <laughs> so, that, no, that makes sense. That's... A decent design decision, I, I I feel like the designers just didn't want to do it. Yeah. And someone at Ubisoft was like, uh, tower defense minigames. That's what the kids are into. Yeah. Everybody wants it. More plants versus zombies. Yes. More dank memes. <laughs> Alright. So basically now just do this again, but don't fall. Yeah. That worked. There. Now you're in chalkboard land. Yeah. Learning where to go. Alright. Um. Okay. More laser rooms. Because of course. Always with the them. laser rooms. Come on, Virgil. <laughs> it's your job. Virgil, just be careful you don't trigger the tempering mechanism. Um, I've taken down Femis Frequency four times. <laughs> you think I don't know how to do this? I've hacked their YouTube page so many times. Not bingo. Oh, that's bullshit. <laughs> that's your brother for you. Virgil, you must not let yourself get dragged into limbo, or you will lose your ability to hack the servers. If you are detected, it's all over. Let's do some. Let's do a hacking mini game. Oh. All right, got it. Yep. I'm. I'm understanding. Yeah. Good job. Thanks for nothing, Virgil. Oh, hey you. All right. I do like these things. They are oh yeah. No, they look very cool. I'm just like laughing at the samurai sword. Uh, stopping a bullet thing. They're very coolly designed. Like, all yeah. the enemies in here are either gross or cool or both. Yeah. Like that one, like, the slurm monster that you fought. Yeah. That was both gross and cool, because she was gross, but she was also very funny, which yeah. I appreciate in a boss. If you like funny bosses, you love the rest of the Devil May Cry series. I don't know. I don't feel like I can play any of these. I don't say you were playing them. You need to watch me do it. All right. Are the, are don't you just like to watch? Sometimes? Well, I mean, sometimes. That's what the internet is for. So I want to make sure that's like, yes. Okay, that yeah. is the way that I should be yeah, going. Yeah, it was curving. It was listing to the left. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I also like that the uh, lasers that are going to be disabled are a different color. Yep. Okay. That's where she wants me to go. You're going to go What is way? over here? 
some items and health things. And after that, we can go to the next place next time on Two Gay Guys Play. Oh, all right. Yeah, so more of that. Bye.